Hypnos has been making mattresses and beds for over 100 years. We had a fantastic opportunity to talk to Amira and look at a collaboration which brought design to the front and brought pattern and fabric pattern to the front. And we were able to look at how we would work with a younger design community to essentially create great fabric that could be applied to some brilliant looking headboards. And we have now three amazing looking beds. When Hypnos approached me about this, I just knew it would be such an exciting collaboration because it's that mix of a British heritage brand and bringing in new designers and really experimenting with what they have to offer. And Hypnos were brilliant because they did just let me run wild. And eventually we came up with three very distinct looking beds for three very different people. So for the sand, which is the room that we're in now, we have this tribal theme. It's bold, it's sassy, and the gold colour I thought we could balance out with some contemporary touches. So I wanted this to feel confident and modern. The med evokes the nautical, but I've also played with impressionism for an abstract effect. Blue is a very soothing colour for a bedroom, so I wanted to incorporate different shades in a calming, fresh way. I suppose what we're about is kind of creating these awesome textiles that um, kind of go on a huge range of things. So we really concentrate on using those more higher end, more specialist techniques to develop design works which create you know, much more modern, interesting pieces. The textures we looked at and, and chose really came from the brief from Amira. She sent us um, a lot of uh, mood images based around an impressionist artwork and um, we used the colours and the, the shapes that we were seeing on bits of concrete, the paint splats and things like that to then use those as the elements that we built the design from. So for the swan I wanted to strip the bed of colour so we could focus on this cool graphic design. I've spent a lot of time in Scandinavia recently and it definitely has those influences. It's for fans of monochrome, minimalism and that edgy Stockholm style. I've always, always been interested in geometrics and texture and block colour and um, bold shapes I suppose. I think it's just really clean and it's really powerful and it's just great to see the fabric as, as a headboard because it almost becomes like a framed piece of art, doesn't Definitely. it? It's been so incredible to work with Hypnos. They're an iconic British brand. They've been doing what they've been doing for so long, they're Royal Warren holders. And actually it's when I stepped into the factory and saw these skilled artisans at work and the opportunity to work with a heritage brand like that but also to bring modern influences in and to work with young fabric makers that are really just making their mark. It was really something that I don't think a lot of people get to experience. So it's been an absolute joy. We've got over 100 years of bed making experience, been manufacturing mattresses and beds since uh, Edwardian days. And in 1929, we were awarded with our first royal warrant for King George V. We have a huge amount of experience but also it's very important that we stay very modern and very forward thinking. Partnering up with Amira has helped us to develop very striking, current, high quality products, making the bed a real feature of, uh, of the bedroom. For me, a beautiful bed very much is the centrepiece of any bedroom, not only in terms of the comfort and the time you'll spend in the bed, but as soon as you walk into that bedroom, that bed's got to stand out. It has to look amazing. So everything we've been doing is about quality. I think what we have is a collection here that we can be very proud of that celebrates British design and celebrates British craftsmanship, which are two subjects that are so close to my heart.